So I was, I'm so thrilled to talk about uh, Ann Richards because uh, I knew a lot of women like this. There's this. This is a, this is a almost a character type in yeah, the way that I agree. very strong, very strong. But you might not know that at first. This is a very complex character. She was very complex, and I, you know, some of you might have read something about the play. You already know this. I did not know her, and I'm. It may surprise some of you to know that I am not from Texas. <laughs> Yes, I'm not from Texas. That's right, I'm it's not okay. from Texas, but I want Texas anyway. I just uh, responded very well to this woman. I met her once that had nothing to do with my writing this play. And uh, I was swept up when she died with a really consuming morning that was completely I illogical, given that I didn't know her. It was very personal. I was really uh, inconsolable. I just thought, what the hell is this? And I realized after some months, as it just persisted, and I was sort of childish about it, like, I can't stand this. I, she was so young. I, I realized that I had always counted on that voice, like my favorite aunt, who also died at 73 unexpectedly. I mean, unexpectedly for me. Um, I was like, how can that voice not be in my life anymore? I mean, it's really very childish kind of upset. And then I, at some point I realized, wait a minute, it's, I'm not just talking about me, I'm sad for the country. We need that voice. And I didn't even know what I meant by that voice. Because this was all just emotional, you understand? It was like when you lose something, you go, oh, oh, oh what, what? You think, what, what was that? Who was that? And so that was the kind of sense that I had. And I, being an actor, I just, had juices that said, well, maybe you could act her. I mean, I wanted to do something with what I felt, and uh, I had various ideas, none of which I followed through on. And one day I'm driving to Two and a Half Men, I'm driving to work in the morning, I'm on the uh, this sort of side road up to Barm, and I'm ch chastising myself. Why, why haven't you done something? You know people who would produce something. Norman Lear? Uh, George Clooney, Tom Hanks, I mean, th these guys would be keen on. And it literally struck me, I was, you know, st the guy on the road to Damascus time, I, I realized it was a play, that it's theatrical, that she's theatrical, that she's about the live connection with an audience. That's what she was. That's who she was, amongst other things.